you know, sometimes things just go bad. And I mean, this <laughs> Durafly ugly stick is to me, I think it's just a fantastic and, and fun flying RC airplane. I really like the design of this one as well. It is rather, rather small at 1100 millimeter. It's lightweight, it's easy to put together and, and take apart again. But as you can see, I have half a prop on this one. And honestly, I think these uh, landing gears, I don't know if they are really in place. Uh, but uh, I mean, this is the weak spot on this RC airplane because this mounting point, if you have like a rough, like a rough landing, uh, you probably will just rip the, the landing gears out totally. And that was what happened to me. I was going in for the landing. There were some uh, you know, rough <laughs> things I got caught in. And, and uh, even though not with a great force, and the landing gears just you know, stripped straight off and, and went nose down uh, pretty you know, on a low attitude. And this really nice wooden prop just broke in half. So, I mean, apart from, from the landing gear mounting, which is really weak on this one, which is something I suppose I have to fix somehow, I think this is a, a, a super fun RC airplane. As I said, easy to put together. Uh, and you have this uh, front hatch as well to put the battery inside. Uh, so this one uses an XT60 connector as well. Uh, I mean, it's an interesting design. Uh, and a, like a kind of a classic RC airplane, really uncomplicated and, and known for its uh, aerobatic capabilities. Um, so just you know, watch the flight on this one, where the still, uh, where the prop is still in one piece, um, uh, because it's it's just a really fun RC airplane which you can continue to push uh, for a really long time as well. Because I mean, I think you can do like easy, maybe eight minutes on this one on a 2200 milliamp battery and then you're still pushing it. So let's just watch the flight on this um, Durafly ugly stick then. This is a great RC plane to just toss around in the sky any way you please. So this is just what I'm going to do with this ugly stick. Let's, uh, let's go then. Today is a great day to fly an RC airplane. Very little wind, just a few gusts, a cloudy sky, which makes for excellent orientation. You can more or less drive this one as in a car, just push it, toss it any way you like and it will just keep on flying. Time remaining, three minutes. So even the wings with these white sections and the cross, in my opinion, makes for excellent orientation.
And if you do consider different aspects of RC airplanes, when you have a plane like this, which is small, yet large enough to be visible, power enough and agile enough to do things, and you can still go quite docile and slow if you like, and control as well, without any really bad habits. I think, I mean, really close to RC airplane perfection. So of course I'm a little bit interested to fly different brands where they have a kind of a ugly stick design. And in a way I think the FMS Super EC kind of is like an, a more modern version of an ugly stick as well. So even uh, when the wind is gusting, this one flies really rock steady. Timer is almost up, but I know that uh, after like six minutes of flight time, I usually have at least 40 or 50 percent battery left. So it's a little bit bouncy on landings, but this field is also rough. And it is a fun one. As I said, really close to perfection. I wish the landing gears would be better, but uh, that's the one thing I'm actually complaining about. As you can see, this is just a fantastic flying RC airplane. Uh, I wish more RC airplanes would be as fun as this one, because even though I'm just going, you know, more or less full of throttle, I'm, I'm pushing this one, I'm rolling, I'm looping, I'm going tight turns. First of all, the battery just keeps on going, it doesn't get warm. Um, and, and what, what's even more impressive is this airframe doesn't get confused because sometimes when I'm, when I'm just going, you know, really full crazy on the sticks and do two tight maneuvers, I can actually feel that some RC airplanes do become really squirrely because I push them and myself over the limit. Uh, but this one, I mean, I haven't experienced anything uh, bad when you're really pushing this one. So apart from the landing gear, then as I mentioned in the beginning, which is really the weak spot and a really sad thing, because if, if the landing gears had would been really solid, I would have a you know a working prop, and, and I would really consider this one to be one of the greatest uh, you know fun planes to fly in this size. So that's uh, some more opinions then about about this Durafly ugly stick version too.